How's it going, guys? Today we're going to be reviewing a movie, and this movie was suggested by these two lovely people right here. Um, yeah, this movie we're going to be reviewing today is the one and only Jeepers Creepers. Um, it is a 2001 horror film, and it stars Justin Long. Justin Long. I actually believe this was his first film film. I'm not too sure, but if not his first, definitely one of his first, because he looks very young in here, but yeah, Jeepers Creepers. Everybody's seen it, everybody knows about it, and pretty much everybody loves it, but um, in case you've never heard of it, or don't know what it is, or never seen it, um, it is a film about these two, I, I believe they're a brother and a sister. They are driving, uh, they're on a road trip. I forget it's been a long time since I've seen this movie, but they're on some sort of road trip, and they find a... Man, I really cannot remember what happens. I want to say their car breaks down or something. I don't remember, but, like, they walk into this tunnel where they find these dead bodies in there. These, like, rotting corpses with, like, they're, like, all nasty and stuff. And they find out that there are there's a person that is murdering their, these people. So, um, the person who murders these people finds out that these people know about it, and, um, so he's sort of just chasing after them throughout the whole movie. It's actually really interesting, but the really interesting part is that the person chasing after them, or the guy who murdered all these people, let's just say he's not human. What the hell is his name? His name is, like, Mr. Creeper? Mr. Jeeper Weeper? I don't know. His name... I think it's the Creeper. The Creeper. I think that's it. Yeah, they call him the Creeper. And he... He apparently... He's not human. He's like a demon or some sort of weird looking creature. But... Yeah, so basically the whole movie is just them trying to get away from this creature. Um, you know, they try to contact the sheriff and whatnot. You just have to watch it. It's a really fun, awesome horror movie. And unfortunately, uh, I do not have it or the sequel. So... I will definitely be looking forward to those, or looking for those, sooner or later. I did hear that they are making a Jeepers Creepers 3 this year called... What's it called? I forget. But they're making a Jeepers Creepers 3 movie, apparently, coming out this year. Um, I keep hearing rumors about it. Not sure if it's a real something that's going to actually happen, or if it's just another rumor. I don't know. But I'm pretty um, looking forward to it. Um, but yeah, as for the movie, I really did enjoy this film. It's just a really fun film. Sort of like a cat and mouse film, almost. Uh, it's it's really awesome and enjoyable, and you should watch it if you have not yet. Mr. Creeper, or I, I think it's The Creeper, or Mr. Creeper. I cannot remember his name, but... Um, yeah, he, uh, since 2001, when the film came out, he has become, like, a horror icon along with, uh, like, the, a recent horror icon along with Victor Crawley, Leslie Vernon, Chrome Skull. He's, like, he's a recent horror icon. I don't know if that makes sense or not, but, yeah. Overall, I would probably give Jeepers Creepers a 3.5 out of 5 star rating. Um, it's a very fun film. I don't want to say it's like a cult classic or destined to be a cult classic film. Um, it's just a very fun, awesome movie. Um, not, it's not like going to be the best horror movie you've ever seen, but it's still a pretty fun movie. I think it's like a movie where you watch on a Friday night with a bunch of friends. It's like a popcorn flick. But yeah, I really enjoyed it. If you have not seen this yet, please do. It's a great movie, but yeah. Alright guys, that is it for today's review. Please check out my review for the sequel, Jeepers Creepers 2, and I will see you guys later. Oh, don't forget to leave a suggestion on what movie I should review next, and I will see you guys later.